guys, welcome back. My name is Alyssa. I am here to do another thrift haul for you guys. Uh, it's been a while since I did the last one, um, almost six months actually, which is kind of crazy because I pretty much thrift on a weekly basis. Um, I go to a lot of thrift shops in my local area and just get a ton of stuff and I keep a lot of it and I resell a lot of it and I never pay full price for anything. So this haul I wanted to share with you guys all about my um, trip to the Garment District in Cambridge, Massachusetts, which is about an hour and a half from where I live. Um, I live in Maine, so that's south of me, Spo. But I typically get make it down to Massachusetts like every few months or so, so it's kind of like a fun um, trip to tie in with seeing friends or doing other things when I'm in like the Boston area so there's like actually um quite a few other little thrift shops that are fun to hit up when I'm in the area as well but I really like this garment district they have a lot of used clothing um contemporary vintage and just modern stuff which is really cool um and they have a lot of costumes um I can't really say I've Bought anything from the costume section but I mean around Halloween I'm sure that's like a really fun place to shop but um, and then so my favorite part of the garment district is they have this little room blocked off specifically for digging through clothes that are on the floor and you basically pick the items that you want and you get to fill a bag and they weigh it and you pay for these items by the pound and I believe it's two dollars a pound so um, it can add up but you know you can fill a bag with so many things and get some really cool items so basically that's my favorite part and why I really like shopping there um, so I did that with um, one of my really good friends, Lauren, that lives in the area now, which is really fun because that gives me an excuse to go there more often. And I got a ton of stuff and I filled a bag and I think I paid around $20 for everything that I got that day. Um, I don't remember the weight of the bag, but you know, that can vary with however each item weighs. I got a lot of jackets and sweaters, so you know, um, that kind of weighed it down a little bit. So anyways, I figured I'd show you guys what I got that day, which was actually almost a week ago, and I've been meaning to do this video for like a week, but I've been really busy and um, the bag has been sitting in the trunk of my car until I did this video. So. I um, kind of had to refresh myself with what I got because I totally forgot, but I got um, really excited about everything. So here we go. I will show you guys what I got. Okay, so the first one that I'm trying on is this Forever 21 denim jacket. It's a little bit oversized on me. Um, it might be a little bit too oversized. I might just end up selling this, but... I thought it was really cute with the studs on the back and I like the wash of it, the light wash. So this next one was from the brand Alternative and it was brand new, it literally still had the tag on it which is so cool. And it's this really nice light pink hoodie sweatshirt that I thought was really cute. I've really been liking this color lately. And I would just go with anything like a t-shirt or a tank top and just super comfy, cozy. This really awesome flannel from Levi's and I just really like the big plaid style and the colors that were in this one. And it had snap buttons which is really easy and it's on the heavier side for flannel which is nice because that keeps you a little bit warmer than a thin one. So I really like this. Um, be cute to tie up in the summertime and wear with high-waisted jeans or something so I really like this I'll definitely be keeping this so this one was another brand new sweater from atmosphere is the brand but the tag is from the store Primark or Primark I'm not really sure how you say that but super cute has a lot of really iridescent um, sequins in it which is cute and just a cozy black sweater for winter time you can never have enough of that stuff.
I really like this print of the sweater when I saw it and picked it up. I like the maroon red color with the off-white. Um, and it's super cozy, super warm, has a nice hood if I want to wear that. And I really like this. And this is from the brand Bongo. So not really an expensive brand. So this one was something that I really got excited about when I picked it up and saw it. It's definitely a unique item. It's from Nine West and it is big on me. It's an extra large, but I thought it was so cute with all the fringe and the fluff and I like the gray color. So I'm not really sure if I really see myself wearing this one, but I really did like it and I would like to wear it, but we'll see. I'll probably keep it around for a while and see what happens. So I hope you guys enjoyed my thrift haul from all the items that I got from the garment district and the by the pound section. So I will try and keep up with making these thrift hauls for you guys because like I said I pretty much thrift on a weekly basis and I always find really good items, really good finds for an awesome price and I am more than happy to share that with everybody and all my little tips and tricks to thrift shopping and getting things for super cheap. So keep the eye out for the next one and thanks for watching guys. As always, keep liking and subscribing and I really appreciate it from everybody. Thanks guys, bye.